nail biter of a set. Zamba looked so good. And Zamba has still making some good runs, obviously coming off of a nice win earlier in the year for one of those big major tournaments in Genesis. It's gonna be game one on small battlefield, and Light has a abs tag. But Zamba might need to heed the advice right now. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's already coming out of the gate, and this is one of the things that we love about Light is just his pure aggression when it comes just out of the gate. And one of the things about Light, too, is that the way that he kind of is putting off pressure on the ledge right now is only allowing for Zamba to come back onto stage with certain options, right? So a lot of these nares, but we need to see more of these combos here going to actually get oh. kind of jammed out by the forward air, but wrong positioning on Zamba is going to allow for Light to kind of get back into control here. And one of the things that I love about his play AG or the placement of Nairs specifically. Right, right. Sometimes not necessarily a combo starter, but it's sort of an option cut off. Really good pressure right there and what an anti-air. The gyro slowing down that hit of the neutral air. Gonna get punished by light. And you talked about that offense, but the problem is one misstep and Zamba can capitalize, but these angles are phenomenal from light. Second rotor arms is going to miss here. I like the way that Light is always trying to mix up the approach too. We saw the grab right there and we're seeing the grabs once again. Zamba has yet to adjust here. There's the forward throw though, trying to mix up the DI. The gyro toss does hit, but the laser unfortunately uncorrect. But there it is, the up air right below the ledge, the Rob Classic. Going to be able to even it back up, but I still think Zamba is trailing in terms of the aggression. A little bit here, but Zamba can definitely make something happen. Unfortunately, you kind of have to take pretty big combo to get it started. Nice chase on the roll as well, keeping it going, but misses that up air read on the platform. However, he somehow finds the way. 104, Zamba on the back foot, and there's the parry up tilt, threatening the back air, but not going to go for it quite yet. I mean, doesn't even need to, right? I mean, he is so far ahead. No tech, no stock. And Light going to have a massive lead. Look at that. They both started second stocks very low percentage. And now Light on the verge of even just taking Zamba again. Here we go. Down still into the forward air. Double forward air. Finds the up air as well. And now Zamba forced to retreat here. Trying to get something. But he rolls right into another up tilt. And Light is just going to take this combo all the way up. Oh, it's so tough. Basically, anytime action's happening on the stage, Light is running away with it. Anytime it's off the stage, Zamba is making it look easy. But right now, it's going to be hard. Zamba's going to have to make something happen. But Light has been picking all the right options. Somehow finds the ledge with the side special, and the up tilt back air is going to set up that edge guard yet again. Yeah, definitely not a great game from Zamba right now. The air dodge down to ledge, though, will allow for Zamba to have one more chance here. But still, these up tilts are leading into certain destruction every single time Light is finding the man. And even if he doesn't go all the way through it, he still gets all of this like consistent damage just off of an up tilt. It is very, very impressive right. how he's able to adapt and adjust. Yeah, and there is something to be said too. Uh, thank you, production. Perfect timing. The interaction over on the left side of the stage here that we kind of saw, which we will get to eventually, is kind of what led to that eventual back air. We missed a little bit of it just before <laughs> he's so that confused. clip. Yeah, he's, Did you see that? Well, that's the thing. I don't think he thought that was going to kill, but Zamba was not necessarily getting hit by too many back airs either. And Light... <laughs> Was I'm ready? Trying, Devin. No, you're, you're doing great. <laughs> Light was ready <laughs> to kind of follow up on that, but a couple of lasers landed over on the left side as well, <laughs> which always helps with the move scale, and we've talked about that so many times before. But a lot, Light picked a lot of the right options there to kind of keep that pressure up, no matter even after Zombo was out of the corner, it still just led to some more advantage state for light. We're going to run right back into the next game here, and what do you think Zamba needs to do to kind of slow it down a little bit? Jeez, just not approach like he's been approaching. I mean, how many times did we see Zamba kind of roll into light there, and then light was just like, bet, I'll find the up tilt, but already here, I like how we're going to Battlefield to try and find another escape option, but the problem is you're trying to escape versus one of the most aggressive players in the game, and that's kind of just not going to be able to happen. Look at this, the way that light is able to stack up damage, it just doesn't seem like Zamba has a game plan at all. Yeah, a lot of up airs there too. Just racking on the damage. That back air setting up for the edge guard one more time. You, you know, a lot of people have some feelings about that move. Even if it doesn't take the stock, it just sets you up for a good spot. But Zamba has really interesting combo routes. Just not really finding that finishing hit kind of been the deciding factor. Not finding the edge guard or the rotor arms, but Ooh. these back airs are setting up for a good spot. Great angle from Light, though, on the recovery. Going to be able to respond, but here comes Zamba. Finally finding these parries and trying to find the stock here. The down tilt not going to be able to connect here, Whoa. but Light gets the drag down off of the platform, finds the back air as well, and there goes stock, but Zamba definitely coming back up to Light here. Right, right, definitely kind of evening the momentum a little bit more. That down air was a surprising option, though, from Light off of the platform. Don't think Zamba was really ready to parry that. Got hit with the multi-hit. This jab is going to open up the center stage for Light and great spacing around that Nair. Zamba's looking to make something happen here, and this could be it. 
forward throw could potentially be the option, but great mashup by Light. And I love the way that he held on to the ledge, knowing that Zombo was going to go for the rotor arms here. Still, though, the parries from Light have been perfect this game. And now Zamba now starting to bleed out here when that first stock was taken, when it was still very close here. Light going to get the hard read on the F smash. Zamba going to be down three stocks to one. You're asking me what the game plan is. We need to start asking him. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. We have to get pretty creative pretty fast right now. Try and find something that's a really good defensive option there and good timing to get around that falling up air from light. Usually it's kind of hard to time around, but it's stuff from Zamba and a great punish too. Going to try and even it up. We might need to see some of those, you know, Rob signature edge guards <laughs> here though. It's a pretty tall mountain to climb at the moment. Yeah, kind of the, the sneak away fast faller good night right, combo, right. right? Still no, here we go. It's going to be the up throw onto the platform. Finds the Ooh. first forward air, but doesn't find the read on the side special here. So here comes Light once again, finding these nares so perfectly. And speaking of nair, it will be Zamba finding a nair up tilt up air. It is not going to be enough to KO just yet. I oh. love the air dodge down from Light and then able to pick it right back up with an up air. But Zamba nairing a little bit too early is going to allow for Light to get a couple of hits in. Finds the up air. It's not going to be enough, but from a combo that started from Zamba, Light has now taken it back into control. That back air is not going to be able to do it. Light now looking for this finisher. Yeah, 160. You're not going to have a lot of invincibility. The bicycle kick is not going to do it coast to coast. And going for something crazy, Firefox oh, nah. is going to be untackable <laughs> at that percent. And wonderful coverage there from Light going into that game. And he might have to make a call with an executive over at Red Bull or something. <laughs> this, is my, this might have to be the new commercial cut. Might be a little favorite. Right? It might be. Yeah. Who? Yeah, you saw uh, that? That was commercial <laughs> facing. Like, Get that one more time, Dan. Yeah, this was crazy, right? Like, I, I mean, from a stock that started with Zomba really kind of going in and finding a lot of these options, Light was just like, hey, you have momentum, bet. Right, right. It, it makes him one of the best players for me to watch because he oh. really truly plays so like up in your face. I like to call it like ignorant confidence, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, like yeah. I love to say like, hey, I'm better than you. Let me show you why. And that's Light's attitude, man. We're going to town and city. How do you feel about this pick? I like the idea, actually. I think some of the platform configurations can be very good for Zomba. Having a little bit more space can definitely also be beneficial, as long as Light lets you kind of get some of that space, but hasn't really been what we've been seeing in the last couple of games. This is a good opportunity, though. Forward throw to set up the edge guard. I love that. Point blank gyro. No punish right there, though. I'm going to try and reset to neutral. That might have been the first time that we actually saw Zamba actually punish one of the side specials in. And granted, it didn't net him the stock, but it's that top player adaptation that we're starting to see from Zamba, right? But still, though, it, trying to get a little gyro combo of his own. The dash attack's getting a little bit more uh, mileage in this game just because of Town and City like we were talking about, right? A little bit more space for Zamba to retreat, so Light trying to like push Fox a little bit forward to try and get something started here. But look at this little bit of an interaction in center stage. It will be Zamba coming out on top, which might be his first lead this entire set. Right. There we saw some impatience from Light trying to go for too big of a swing. A little bit of a read right there. And there's a lot of deceptive cooldown on that Fox up smash, but it's also pretty good at startup too. So Light does find one, evens it back up. And Zamba on the hunt off of that platform. Doesn't get the roll, though. Somehow Light starts a combo and then drops it. Yeah, that was the first time we actually saw oh. a pretty bold like F smash coming out from Light that didn't really net him anything. And it allowed for Zamba to get some percent. Now, granted, the thing is, I feel like Light's combo game, the punish game, is just a lot harder than Zamba's in this in this set so far. But now here we go, gets the drag down, doesn't read where Zamba's gonna roll, but still, once again, Light, a master of picking up where he left off here. Zamba not gonna get punished for the nair down, but there's the up tilt, and now Zamba trying to stop the bleeding, but look at the way that Light is chasing respectfully, right? He's saying, you know what, I'm gonna respect that nair, but I'm gonna try and call it out while you do it. Exactly, staying just outside of the distance and then reacting because he does have so many different options, a lot of ground speed, a very quick jump as well. And Zamba has been doing really well, but like we said, all set, not finding those key moments, those last hits of the extensions is really costing Zamba because then like it's one opportunity and then runs away with it, putting on that pressure with the back air, gonna force the jump into the up smash and light. Poised to take it 3-0, but Zamba could definitely make something happen here. Zamba has definitely been recovering Ooh. a little low for my liking. I feel like if we're on Town and City, we do have the ability to recover high. Unfortunately, though, going to miss the drop off the stage with the forward air. So now here we go, Light having a little bit of rage and 
still having this stock. We can get something started here. Dash attack, though, not going to be punished, but the, the Nair in will. Unfortunately, though, for Zamba, the small sides of town and city not going to help him here. Regrab is not going to be punished directly, but there's one of those Nairs that essentially stops Zamba's momentum at all costs. Right, in the middle of the up air, too. So Zamba thought, you know, this is a pretty safe option to kind of get back to center stage. Unfortunately, though, gets the reversal, gets stuck on the platform as well, and now you see it kind of slow down a little bit, which is actually better for light. Some more laser damage. You can kind of bait out the gyro or the laser as well. The up throw, though, is going to take that stock. Good option. Sneaking in the grab there from Zamba. Very smart. But Light is definitely on the hunt, going to try and make something happen, and fast. Yeah, I mean, Zamba has to figure out the way that he wants to approach just the Ooh. neutral on this last stock, right? I mean, it's his last stock in winners, and we're not really seeing much for it, right? I mean, it has to be all of this chip damage that Zamba gets, because Light is going to be in Nair up smash range very soon. But here we go. Finds the rotor, finds the stock. Yeah, and that is yeah. exactly why we're on Town and City. Light can't believe it. Zamba's frustrated. I mean... You can see always him in the camera, like he's a very expressive player. Right, and it's right. like, man, like you're really trying to like throw me off, man. So it will not be a blowout. It will be Zamba trying to fight this back, does win a game on winner's finals. But now it's Light's counter pick. Do you think we're going back to a smaller stage? I mean, Light is always the person who, before the screen is even at the result screen, already rotating the fingers, saying to run it back. So I wouldn't be surprised if we ended up back on small battlefield like game one or PS2, uh, which is it's kind of a similar vibe. And also still very good for Fox. Kind of a little shorter on the sides in terms of real estate on the main stage as well. So Light wants that to kind of keep scrapping, keep that pressure up, which was doing wonders for him in games one and two. So looks like it is Pokemon Stadium. There comes the laser and there comes the grab too from almost center stage. I, I gotta talk about it. The yeah. way that Zamba was able to mix up his game plan immediately at the start of three, two, one, no. 3, 2, 1, go. Now, granted, uh, it didn't really yield him anything, but you could already Ooh. see that at the start of the game, Zamba was just like, you know what, let me go to the corner and let me try and play a little bit more defensively. Now, finally going to get something started here with the gyro toss down, but Light was like, oh, nah, I'm not playing around. Oh, single hit up air, too. It looked extra nice. Only 4% basically from chip damage right there, too. Light just boxed Zamba out and just gets so much percent from these up airs. The platforms for PS2 working wonders, catching the roll into forward air into the up air. Got to jump out of that spot, but you are definitely on the back foot to say the least. 96 after one small opening lyric. I don't know. It's going to be tough. Oh, it's going to be so, so <laughs> difficult. The, the thing is, it's just at the end of the day, whose combo game is tighter and it's just lights at the end. Like, it, period. It's it's just right. light. Every, like, situation no. is all just leading up to light. Granted, Zamba was just saved there because Gyro was just in the middle of that combo. But we got to start seeing a combo come out from Zamba now. We need to see a stock. We need to see a good opening. We need to see rotor arms early for even next stock. We have to play in two stocks ahead of this right. point. All right, there's a back here to open up the stage. Samba has a lot of time to get back. A lot of laser charge as well, but can't hold on to that ledge for long. Light was ready. Catches the roll on with the grab to try and force that vertical pressure, but good landing aerial from Zamba. This is actually a really good opportunity, but somehow Light always works around all of the platforms, all of the jumpings, the shieldings. Everything is scouted out. Finds another big hit with that up air. And Zamba on the last stock now. Oh, what? Just threw it back. That's <laughs> just, crazy. Oh, hell no. I'm, I'm Spot dodge cancel. Yeah, you know what? You got it. I, I think one of the, I can always praise this player for light just finds openings everywhere and takes it no matter what. And like these one, two, three piece combos, while yes, they're not netting the stock, he's so confident in his neutral interactions that no matter what, he's able to kind of just get this 55% and right. it matters. Still though, Zamba is going to be able to fire back just a little bit. Light going to take a quick moment to, I guess, collect himself. I mean, he is very, very far in the lead right now. <laughs> yeah, but that's the thing is we've seen Zamba do some pretty explosive stuff off stage. Even game one, which looked pretty light favored, if Zamba made two more decisions correctly, we could have a very different set. Up smash the wrong way, not going to do much right there, but that back air will definitely continue up this edge guard here. It's not going to take the stock. That'd be crazy. It'd be crazy because it definitely gets a little bit weaker here, but there's the back air. Not going to be enough no. just yet. Light very adamant about ending this set with a back air to start us off here at CT GamerCon Top 4, Ooh. but it will just be the falling fair into up air that gives Zamba another lease on life, at least for the yeah. moment here. Good parry, but still Zamba, I feel like at this point you're just way too far behind. 
but Get Up Attack is going to send Light off, going for the ledge trump, but Zamba kind of flying a little bit too far. There he is, finds the up smash there, will be Light winning winner's finals 3-1, but I gotta say, for as well as Light played, I don't think Zamba played well at all. Yeah, I'll give it up. I mean, it wasn't anyone's finest moment. No, uh, We kind of said that with the top four competitors too, like, I don't know if anyone's really at the top of their game right now. They're all kind of getting comfortable again. Stretching out the hamstring. It's been, it's been like a pretty you know long bracket, and we had a lot of stream matches as well, so yeah. they may not be warming up or staying warm in between some of them, but a lot of people are looking forward to all the other wonderful festivities we have here That's at Connecticut's true. Terrific.